everyone welcome back to substance tv so guys today we are diving into the movie review bucket which stars clinton joshua chinaya nebe amongst others yeah so this film has basically sparked mixed reactions okay people giving it a no no and some people giving it a hundred over hundred okay so but after watching it i had my own take on this story okay first off I would have to commend Mr. Uchina Obunabo for creating such an amazing movie bucket, okay? It's a standout production, delving into the real-life experiences and highlighting important issues like mental health. It's a 2 hours, 28 minutes movie that basically journeys us into challenges people face with their mental well-being. So, after seeing this movie, I literally read some comments about the movie and I realized something that people are not focused on what's the movie is trying to bring okay people just want to see two actors filming and giving us the best romantic movie ever but no that is not what the movie says okay so this particular person was like the chemistry is not chemistry you know we want to see the being in love now a romantic movie chinaye and clinton and this one says i just lost interest when clinton and chinaye were separated from the movie yes i understand this particular person's feeling okay but the thing is the beauty of a movie is to have beautiful actresses and actors explore you know certain roles together we don't necessarily have to have the same people filming this particular um filming together all the time okay and it's not even as if chinaye nembe and clinton joshua have been doing this for the longest of time no we just watched their movie some time ago you know we enjoyed their movie and you know people started liking both of them together but this particular lady that was used to act with clinton joshua you know i basically loved how she played the role i love the fact that she brought light to the movie okay and trust me guys i basically felt the chemistry between both of them okay i felt the love in their eyes it was glary it was real and i love the fact that she acted that role so very well okay so another person says something i lost interest when clinton chose someone else it not just go well with me i got bored one hour into the movie hmm so guys these are a few of the comments that i got from people okay and we had lovely comments also so yeah this one says great movie by all standard a great message was passed and the plot twist was excellent kudos to everyone who was part of this project guys i totally agree with this one the movie had everything in it okay there was there were no loopholes in this movie i basically love the fact that the actors did well the movie was well projected the the script was excellent you know everything that would, that would make a movie perfect was in this movie all right so guys after seeing this amazing movie bucket i came up with this all right so first off bucket tells the story of beliba portrayed by chinaya nebe a young and beautiful lady who runs away from home to live with her friend in abuja an entirely city far from home yes guys so on her journey she accidentally bought the wrong bus and got robbed late at night fortunately for her a kind stranger named lewis played by clinton joshua comes to her rescue stranded in a new city belma had no place to go so lewis helped her find a hotel but when there were no vacancies he took the risk of letting her stay in his place yeah, so Louis lived with his sister and they both showed her kindness. The next day, Louis ensured that Belma reaches her destination. But his act of kindness sparked something deeper into her. She starts calling Louis frequently and visiting him unannounced, developing strong feelings for him. Louis was a successful poet, calm, kind, and shy harboring feelings for a friend named Tolani. However, he struggled to confess his feelings to Tolani. Meanwhile, Tolani also had feelings for him, but hesitated to make the first move. Okay, so Louis' sister, noticing Tolani's reluctance, became unfriendly towards her, assuming she was taking advantage of her brother's feelings. Belma, on the other hand, became convinced that Louis' romantic poems were written for her. Her clinginess started to upset and annoy Louis. Belma's friend was very concerned about Belma's strange behavior, and she had to reach out to her mother. And it was confirmed that Belma was suffering from a disease called erotonomia, a delusional belief that someone is in love with you when the person is not. Belma's mother rushes to Abuja, but by the time she got there, Belma had already arrived at Louis' house, causing, creating a scene. Before then, guys, 
Louis's sister triggered Louis to speak his mind, okay? After confronting Tolani, who was Louis' crush, okay? She confronted her and she poured out her mind, making Tolani feel so bad. Louis had to rush downstairs on hearing the whole shout and noise, you know, and just had to speak his mind, telling Tolani how much he loves her. Wow! That was the shockest thing that his sister would ever hear, okay? Making her brother confess his feelings to a girl. Alright, so that particular moment was a period of confession. Talani also confessed her feelings to Lewis. So the sister was so happy that they had to, you know, she made it happen. She made it possible that if she hadn't done that, they wouldn't have both confessed their feelings. Okay, so guys, they became lovers rather than friends. And right from that moment, their love grew stronger and stronger. And they had great plans for each other. So guys, while Belima was at their at Louis's apartment creating a scene, he had to inform his sister about it to get the police on her way back. So Belima's mother had reached out to Louis, apologizing to him because she knew that her daughter would have created a scene there, okay? So guys, before she could come, the police were already at his place to pick up Belima, okay? So when he heard about Belima's mental issue, he had pity for her and you know, he made sure that he helped her go through the face all right so he was always there for her calling his mother knowing how the daughter was coping yes guys so in summary bucket is a film that tackles mental health with sensitivity and depth brought to life by powerful performances and a heartfelt storyline it's a movie that stands out not just for its narrative but for its dedication to portraying real life struggles if you haven't seen Bucket yet, it's definitely worth a watch, guys. It's an amazing movie and trust me, guys, all the cast killed their roles. They brought in their A-game and they made sure that this movie was a 10 over 10 minus nothing, guys. Chidaria's character in this movie was wow. Like, I love the way she played the role, you know? It was just super interesting. Okay, she brought life to it. She gave it her best in it. And Clinton Joshua, on the other hand, he played that shy aspect to perfection, guys. I feel like my best character in this movie was the character played by Clinton Joshua. He was wonderful. Even his sister's character and Tolani's character was also perfect. Every one of them brought life to this movie and I must commend them for such an amazing acting. Alright, so guys, they all did well and I will forget to appreciate the entire crew members that made this movie beautiful, okay? Everything about this movie was wonderful. Starting from the lightning to the searching to the editing, everything you could think of in a movie had it, okay? So guys, this movie is a lovely one. And for the script writer of this movie, thank you so very much for this amazing storyline. It is really, really amazing, okay? And for the producer of this movie, Mr. Uchenam Bonabo, thank you so much for always bringing such an amazing movie with lots of moral lessons to learn. From the look of things, guys, I can categorically say that Mr. Uchina Monabo always vets his scripts before making sure that they are being shot, okay? And that is why his movie is always coming out perfect. So guys, that is basically all we have for today. Thank you so very much for watching. Please do all to like this video, share this video, and subscribe to Substance TV for more amazing movie reviews and recommendations. See you all in my next video. Until then, stay splendid.